Welcome to Cool Plugins. In this video, we will learn about Carousal Layout. Create a new page. Give it a title and publish it. After Publish Page, click on Edit with Elementor button. You can select Events Loop Widget from Basic Category. Or in Elementor Search Bar Type Events. Drag and drop it on page. Select Carousal from Select Layout. We have provided different carousal designs. You can view the different different template and select one that you like. In this video, I am selecting classic carousal style one. Select Edit Template button to edit this design. Select how many number of events you'll want to show on slider. Slides to show option use for how many slides you want to show one time in slider. Space between slides option use for give space between slides. Slides height option is used to give equal height to slides. If it is auto, then it adjusts height according to slide height. Because of that text below the slider will move up and down. If it is equal, then the text below the slider will not move up and down. Next is the events query section. You already get to know about all these options in previous videos. One new option is added in this layout is the event offset. It is you for how many first slides you want to skip in slider. Next is Carousal Settings. By default, you have to click on the arrow to scroll slides. If you want to automatically play slider then, you can set the autoplay option to be true. If I hover the mouse on the slides, then it keeps scrolling. To stop this on mouse hover, you can set pause on hover option to be true. Slide speed option use for increase and decrease the slider speed. Next is slide to scroll. By default, only one slide scroll. If you want to scroll more than one slide, then you can change this value. Next is in fine loop. By default, after scrolling all slides, the slider stops. If you want to continue scrolling, then you can set its value to be true. After that, update and view the page. Remaining options we will learn in next video. Thanks for watching.